Picture a machine, capable of thinking. Let's stretch that concept further. What if it could think just like us? This may sound like a story lifted straight from a sci-fi novel, but it's the very question that consumes the minds of those immersed in artificial intelligence. From the hallowed halls of academia to the innovation labs at tech juggernauts, this question fuels research, ignites debates, and revolutionizes industries. Our exploration begins with deep learning, a subfield of AI that draws its blueprint from the human brain. But how accurately does it replicate our cognitive functions? Pause and marvel at the brain, a sophisticated network of billions of neurons, each intricately interconnected, creating a phenomenon of processing power and connectivity. This architecture is mimicked in the digital world by neural networks. Layers of artificial neurons process information and discern patterns. As data sweeps through these layers, each extracts features from rudimentary to complex, forming a hierarchy of learned features. Take speech recognition as an example. Early layers might capture basic sounds, while deeper ones comprehend words, phrases, and eventually the context and sentiment. But can this be termed learning in the way humans understand it? That's where things get hazy. Humans learn from experience, every interaction reshaping our future responses. It's a fluid, evolving process. Neural networks, however, learn from data, tweaking their internal parameters to narrow the gap between their prediction and the actual output. It's mathematical optimization rather than experiential learning. Yet they learn. And this learning enables them to solve intricate problems they weren't explicitly programmed to solve. Recall AlphaGo, the AI model that triumphed over the world champion in Go, a game of greater complexity than chess? It didn't triumph through sheer computation, but by learning strategies from thousands of games and honing them by playing against itself. So do we return to our initial question? Is this thought, its learning, decision-making, and even creativity in its own unique way? But is it thought? The counter-argument insists these models lack understanding. They operate on learned patterns, oblivious of their meaning. Ponder on a language translation model. It can adeptly translate languages it's been trained on, even creating poetic phrases. But does it comprehend language or appreciate poetry? Likely not. In the Turing test, if an AI can converse indistinguishably from a human, it's deemed intelligent. But is it thinking or merely mimicking thought? The argument remains unsettled. As we tread into the future with increasingly advanced AI, it only becomes more intricate. Maybe one day, we'll create an AI that not only thinks, but also possesses self-awareness and consciousness. What then? Will we stare down a dystopian future where AI turns against us? Or will we inhabit a utopia where AI aids us in solving our most pressing problems? We journey deeper into AI's grasp on the arts, traditionally considered the last bastion of human uniqueness. AI created art, music that rivals human composers' works. It's a fascinating prospect. But again, we are drawn back to our central question. Is this genuine creative thought? Imagine an AI after studying countless classical symphonies, crafting music that might make even Mozart nod in appreciation. Now picture an AI learning from the master's techniques, style, and progression, and then producing a painting so profound it could be mistaken for a lost Da Vinci. Consider an AI model penning a gripping tale that has readers gripped. All these scenarios aren't mere conjecture. They are unfolding now. But is this thinking? Is the AI expressing a unique artistic vision or simply regurgitating learned patterns? Human creativity often stems from a fusion of experiences, emotions, and a profound understanding of the medium elements that AI lacks. AI's creations may be impressive and even beautiful, but they stem from pattern recognition in data, not from the rich cognitive and emotional mix that fuels human creativity. This brings us to a crossroads in our debate. Should we gauge AI's cognitive abilities using a human yardstick? Is it even justifiable? After all, AI is fundamentally distinct from us. It processes information, learns, and possibly thinks in ways we don't. The limitations we perceive in AI could be mere differences. The concept of AGI, or artificial general intelligence, looms on the horizon. This type of AI could understand, learn, and apply its intelligence to any intellectual task that a human can. Will AGI truly think? It's a question for the future, but one that merits consideration. Another fascinating field to explore is the arena of AI-human collaboration. Rather than AI supplanting us, it could augment our abilities, 
pushing us to reach new peaks in fields such as science, arts, and medicine. In healthcare, AI's unparalleled data processing could aid in diagnosing diseases with incredible accuracy, while a human doctor's empathy and holistic understanding of the patient's condition steer the treatment. It's an intelligent collaboration, don't you think? In workplaces, AI's proficiency in handling mundane tasks could free humans to pursue more creative, strategic roles. This symbiotic relationship could usher us into an era of productivity and innovation, the likes of which we've never seen before. On a global scale, artificial intelligence could help us combat climate change by optimizing resource use or tackle world hunger by devising sustainable farming techniques. The potential applications are limitless. So as we journey onward, let's continue asking, can AI truly think? But let's also remember to ask, what can we accomplish together with this technology? And while we ruminate on this, let's keep in mind that the future of artificial intelligence and its capabilities isn't solely in the hands of scientists or programmers. It's in ours, societies. As we shape AI, we're also shaping our future. As we conclude today's exploration, we hope you've enjoyed this intellectual journey. If you want to join us on future adventures, don't forget to hit the like button and share this video with your friends. And if you haven't already, do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get notified about our future videos. Until next time, keep thinking, keep questioning, and remember, every great innovation begins with a single thought. See you in the next video.